Hey guys, and welcome to another Tekka tutorial to the Power of Three here. And today I'm going to show you how to create an awesome Tekka server. Yes, this is very hard in comparison to making a normal Minecraft server. And yes, I have done this before, so I know how complicated this is. First thing you want to do is open a browser, go to Google, then you want to go to um, the Tekkit website. Tekkit. And now two things you want to download. First thing, it says here download the Technic Launcher. Click that, it's going to download this zip file. Second thing you want to download is not this Tekkit server because it's 3.1.3 .3. and right now the 3.1.3 .3 Tekkit launcher has some bugs so this is 3.1.2 Tekkit server. What you want to do is go to over the video server scroll down and download the 3.1.2 previous server thingy. That's what you want to do. Next go to the Minecraft dot net minecraft wiki dot net uh, slash wiki I need to remember this that's what it is I think please awesome good now scroll down please computer yes scroll down until you find Mac OS X instructions this is gonna be there but, um, let me just think. Okay, wait, I, I guess first things first, you want to find this. This is the thing that you download from the server. Double click it to open it. And give it a sec. You should find this thing, this folder. What you want to do, double click on it. And open text edit. and click on format and now I know my computer is German it's not the greatest thing for you guys but I know you're smart so go to format and find a third line for me it's in rein text umwandeln for you guys it's going to be something about clear text or 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 free text something like that just click on that and then your thing is going to change to this now go back to your wiki copy and paste this Command C, go back here, Command V, and this is going to happen. So, what you want to do is look at this file, this jar file. It says tech point jar, right? And here it says Minecraft underscore server point jar. But we don't want the Minecraft underscore server, we want the tech it point jar. So just write exactly that there. Fine. Now, um, here with this stuff, you can do something, you can change something with your RAM size. I'm not sure how to do that. Please don't penalize me on that. You can check out some other video, but it should be fine. I've never heard any complaints. I've never had any complaints with my my RAM size, with my RAM taking, whatever. Just keep it like that. And now what you should be able to do is save it and this is important uh, basically you could call any you could call it anything before so you could do start you could do tech it server whatever but the important thing is that I'm just gonna call mine start that you do everything like I do it period so start dot command. Keep it like that. Then save it into your Tekkit server folder. Save it. It should appear here. Perfect. Now close it. Go to terminal. Terminal. And what you do is click C. Oh, sorry. Before you do that, go to your mods. And this is probably only if you're in the Tekkit or Technic 3 three point whatever because there's some bug with the um, nether ores 
So I'm just gonna go here and find the Nether Ores mod. Mod Nether Ores. Just delete that, and that should be fine. So, oops. Open that, and now write ch mod space a plus x space. Just gonna zoom on for that for you guys. Sorry, write exactly that. Now, drag your start command into your terminal. It's not going to look like it did anything, but it did. Now press enter, and you can close terminal. So, now what you do, since you guys don't want to do this, but I will, because I have my previous worlds, which I want in there. So I'm just going to highlight them, drag them in there. For you guys, you just press start command and it's going to start the server and create some random world. But I'm going to keep like this. Press start command. Open it. And it should load my server. It's going to take a bit longer because the TechEd server is a pretty big file. Has lots of mods. So now you can see it's going to generate some random things. Some random files and such on. So just let that load, let it load, let it load, and I would show you, okay, now you can see it works because it says preparing spawn area, it's going to do that about three times, and yeah, um, basically that's it. Um, I'm not going to show you with TechIt because my TechIt takes ages to start, so that's just, that would just be a waste of time. But the next thing I'll show you is if you want to, st and it's going to give you some random warnings. It says keep up, thingy didn't, whatever. That doesn't matter, it still works. And um, so, if you want to play with friends, you will need one more thing. It's called Hamachi. Yes, it is possible to do with different things, with bucket or s things like that, but Hamachi really is the easiest and I've never had problems. So, what you have to do is go to your Google and write in Hamachi. It's going to call, be called Log Me in Hamachi. Just click one of the links, Log Me in Hamachi. And this is important. For me, it's called Nicht Verwalten, but for you, it's going to be called Unmanaged or Not Managed, something like that. Download it. I already have it. You have to install it and things like that, but that's really not hard. If you have problems, you're probably going to be able to find some other video shows you how to um, d install Hamachi so right. So if you download that installed it it's going to give you something that looks like this Hamachi oops no that's the wrong one Hamachi this is going to come um, as soon as you made it you can see that, like, as soon as you open it, you can see this on and off button. It's going to be off, and, like, everything's going to be kind of, like, blank. You click on it, and it's going to generate all your things. So, this number is important at the top. For me, the 25.183.173.217. And remember that, or copy it, or whatever, and find the... I forget what it's called. Find... Find, find, find the server properties. Here. It's going to usually open with text edit. If not, if it asks you, like, what you want to open it, just left click it, open with, and then if it doesn't say text edit, just say with different program and then find text edit in your applications. So, here, um, what you have to do is go to the IP, server IP right here, write in whatever number it says for you, forget everything under the, um, after the slash here. Just write in 25, don't, don't write in what I'm saying right now, write in whatever it says for you, 25.183.173.217, that should be fine, you can do some other things, um, game mode, okay that's perfect, everything fine. And you can also do things like this. I don't want mine to be called the Minecraft server, but I want it to be called to the oops to the power 
of three server. Yay. Okay. Now what you do, just save it. Save it. And it's saved. Now you can close it. And yeah, basically that's it. Um, now all you have to do, go in your tech it multiplayer, create um, or join new server or add server or whatever it says. Just write your IP that says here and you're ready to go. It's gonna like um, when you install Lock Me and Amachi, I'm just gonna help you how to make it for your friends. Um, it's gonna ask you for a password and things like that that you create an account. And all you all your friends do is also download Hamachi and then they they will go to network, join existing network. You will have to make create a network, but um, your friends have to join an existing network, write in the name of the network, write in the password of the network, and then just in tech it um, add a server and write in the IP, which is this number that you wrote into the server properties. And that's it, then they can add um, join your server and yeah, basically, now you have a TechIt server, 3.1.2. Hope you enjoyed. If you have any questions, any problems, any, any improvements, anything, just either leave a video response or like. No, not or like. You have to like. <laughs> uh, just subscribe, like. You can send us a video, send us a message, comment, whatever. Um, guys, feel free. No problems. To the power of three here, and see you at our next Tech It Tutorials episode. Bye bye.